Hey, what's up guys? So today I'm gonna be working on my Mini Cooper's lights. Cause these shits are hazy. Could clear them up, but I decided not to just go with these. Shit out. <laughs> Instructions. I think these are the ones that are known depot helix lights. Installing some yellow fog light LED bulbs and some new light housing halo housing So instead of having those, I don't have these. I'll try to take you guys through it and then post a final picture and see what you guys think. Maybe a night picture just to see how it looks. So excuse the dirty engine bay, but it's about one, two, three, it looks like size eight nuts. And this should pop out. Currently has HIDs, this is how I bought the car, so might swap out to LEDs depending on how they look. But I'll get to taking them off and I'll show you guys after how it looks with them off. So what you want to go ahead and do is disconnect all this stuff. Uh, I gotta deal with this whole HID stuff because it was already in here, but mine actually switch out to LEDs. Probably the best bet. Um, and then this is the old housing. And this is a new one. Make sure you transfer out the high beam, which I'll probably end up replacing for some yellow bulbs later on. swap all over the HIDs so we'll see how it looks after when it's all done I'll try to take a picture of one of them is on at least for the time being and we'll see what's up this is how they look let's put the nuts back on fix the wiring after but this is how they started to look right now Comparison. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh wee. Lights pull straight out after you're done. Admire your new headlights. I still gotta install the little parking things, but I'll get to that right now. For that, you have to actually remove the bumper, which kind of sucks. Not too difficult, but should be only a few. I believe it's this nut right here, this one. Yeah, I think there's like two more somewhere here, somewhere. But we'll get to it right now. All right, so to remove the bumper, you remove that screw bolt whether here here and another one here zip ties are life yo <laughs> that was previous owner not me I just got this car about two weeks ago so and I believe there's a gang of little screws at the bottom of that this is bumper should be one well maybe not this one but I should want two, three, four, five. Should be about seven of them. And this thing should come right off. What the hell is that? Hmm. So after you take off all the screws, um, disconnect the harnesses. Should be one, two, three on this side and then the ambient temp sensor and it should slide off so I'm gonna remove these whole housings and put the black housing ones and I'll 
Let's see how it looks after. This is the difference. Don't mind that LED. I put that LED in there because I like those yellow ones. I'm pretty sure you're gonna have to reuse this. I am gonna replace these with some chrome amber bulbs because I don't want them to be sticking out through the color. But well, you can see the difference between these and these. These actually have a LED halo, which is pretty cool. Uh, they cost me 40 bucks, I believe. Yeah, $40. For $40, man, this is a cool as upgrade. Better than having those. At least it'll go more with my headlights. I am planning to get some black grills too, which I'll post a few write-ups on that later on too. But yeah, man, we'll get to it and put the bumper back on and I'll show you guys how it looks. I gotta get new bulbs, I gotta get LEDs. Those are high beam LEDs from Amazon. 